In this video, we'll show you how to scan models for a single crown using eScanner. Before scanning, please create a new order in Dental Manager. In the Scan settings, select Model, Antagonist Model, and Sectioned. Then create an order for a crown in Order Details. Click the Scan button to continue. The message, Insert the Preparation Arch, will appear in the Scan It Dental window. Please place the correct model, affixed with blue tack, onto one of the plates, which were packaged with the scanner. Then insert it into the scanner. Remember that it is not necessary to click Next if you have enabled the Auto Start option in the settings. In that case, the scanner will start scanning automatically. To ensure good scan results, do not block or disturb the scanner arm and object during its operation. After a short scanning, the pre-scan model will appear on the screen. You will be prompted to mark the preparation by placing a point on the margin line with the mouse on the buckle side of the tooth. Then you have the option to choose the shape of the scan area. In order to scan the whole model, click the green Select All button. Click Next to proceed. Once the scanning process of the preparation arch is completed, you will see a 3D model of the scanned area on the screen. Take the preparation arch out of the scanner and click Next. Now you're going to be asked to insert the antagonist arch. Place the antagonist model on a plate using the blue tack and insert into the scanner and wait until the scanner will start scanning if Auto Start option is enabled. Based on the selection of the preparation arch, the software will pre select the area on the antagonist or you can click the Select All button and then Next to continue. After scanning the antagonist model, click Next. Remove the antagonist model from the scanner. The software will ask you to insert the upper and lower arches to scan the bite. Position the models together using either the two cast fixture tool or you can securely place them together using wax. Insert it into the scanner and just wait until the scanner starts scanning if the auto start option is enabled. You can now review the bite alignment and remove the models from the scanner. After that, click Next to proceed. The next step of the scanning process is to scan a single die. Remove the die from the preparation model and place it with the blue tack in the center of the plate. Insert it into the scanner and wait until the scanner starts scanning, if Auto Start option is enabled. After the scan, you can check the alignment of the die within the model. After the alignment has been performed, remove the die from the scanner and click Next to proceed. In this step, you can check the scanning result. The sliders in the upper right corner enable you to switch off lower and upper arch. Depending on the version of the e-scanner you have, the scans may be monochromatic for the E1 and the E2. The E2 scanner will also have texture added to the scan like in our case. E3 scanners will have color scans with texture. Once the scanning is finished, you can go straight to the dental designer by clicking the Design button. We hope our video was helpful and thank you for watching.